FMPRO Migrator connects to FileMaker databases using an ODBC connection in order to accurately read and transfer data. In order to connect to a FileMaker database, the FileMaker application and your FP7 or FMP12 database file must be open. Select the File Sharing Enable ODBC JDBC menu to enable sharing for each database file for all users. Make sure that you use a FileMaker login account having the full access privilege set. So in the ODBC settings window, click on the on radio button, click the all users radio button, and then click the OK button. You should avoid running FMPro Migrator on the same machine which is running FileMaker Server. Because FileMaker Server intercepts all ODBC connections to port 2399, so you cannot connect to a database unless it is being served by FileMaker Server on that machine. It makes troubleshooting more difficult. FMPro Migrator has the ability to delete unstored calc fields within your FileMaker database. So don't connect to your production database server. You should copy the most recent backup file from your FileMaker server over to the computer which is running FMPro Migrator. Download the XDBC update file from the FileMaker website. The latest ODBC drivers work with FileMaker 11 and higher versions. Double-clicking the installer extracts the files into the installer folder. If you're using the 64-bit version of FileMaker, then install both the 32-bit and 64-bit ODBC drivers. FMPro Migrator is a 32-bit application, therefore both drivers are needed. It can be helpful to create shortcuts for both the 32-bit and 64-bit ODBC administrator apps in the Start menu. DSNs created with one version of the ODBC administrator are not seen by the other one. When using a 64-bit version of FileMaker on Windows, you will need to create both a 32-bit and 64-bit ODBC DSN having exactly the same name. Otherwise, you will get an architecture mismatch error. Create a system DSN with both ODBC administrator programs. For this example, I'm starting with the 64-bit ODBC administrator. Click the Add button, click the FileMaker ODBC driver, and then click the Finish button. Click the Next button, Click the Next button on this screen. Now notice that this is the 64-bit ODBC administrator and that the text states that an additional DSN needs created for 32-bit applications. Enter localhost to connect to a FileMaker database running locally on your computer. Click the checkbox next to Connect to the FileMaker application to get the list of database files being shared. This is done for troubleshooting purposes to make sure that we can successfully make a connection to FileMaker. Click the Next button. If you get a connection error, this is the dialog which will be displayed. Double check to make sure that the FileMaker application is running and that your database file is opened with ODBC sharing enabled. Once you have successfully connected, select your database file from the menu. This selection needs changed for each new database file. Click the Advanced Language button. Uncheck the Auto Detect checkbox. Select UTF-8 from the encoding menu, click the OK button. FileMaker uses UTF-8 as its internal encoding format, and FMPro Migrator expects all data 
to be in the UTF-8 format for accurate data transfers into a SQL database. Click the Next button. Click the Test button. Enter the login username. Enter the password if there is one. And click the OK button. If the test fails, double check the login account name and password info. Make sure that you are logging in with an admin account having full access privileges. The login account must have the FM XDBC extended privilege and the full access account already has this extended privilege. Click the OK button and try again. Unless this test passes, FM Pro Migrator will be unable to log in to the FileMaker database. For some types of errors, it is necessary to restart your computer and try again. Once the test passes, click the OK button. Click the Done button. Now repeat this same process again using the 32-bit ODBC administrator. Create the 32-bit ODBC DSN with the same name and settings.